name's Bruce Wade and welcome to SETS Speaker Education Tips, where we help develop both you and your speaking business. So I want to chat to you today about defining your audience, because we see so many speakers uh, say, you know, the answer, who do you speak to? Well, everyone. And that is the wrong answer. A good speaker, a good professional speaker that commands high fees and regular bookings is somebody who's focused in and knows exactly who their target audience is and who their target audience should be. You should even know the type of education position in the company, the sector that they work, work with, and their commanding relationship as far as spend capital is concerned, as well as maybe some form of numbers that you know that for every person I speak to, I can convert that amount out of this person at this level, but this amount out of this person as a forward upsell and a resell option. So defining your target audience becomes one of the critical factors that you don't put out on your website and you don't broadcast it. It's an internal document that you know. So if someone says, won't you speak at X event, you just don't see, well, speaking, yes, please, I'm going to do that. You are able to analyze, well, who are the audiences? Is this audience within the realm of my target audience? If it is, then it's a go. If it is not, you've got to be brave and bold enough and say, no, may I refer to one of my colleagues? doesn't happen too often. Speakers seem to try and adapt and adjust to be able to cope because they're chasing the money instead of the bigger picture, which is following the passion and the problem and your target audience. So knowing who your target audience gives you very clear indication of where to speak. It also allows you the opportunity to accept a speaking engagement, maybe at a lower price or for free, because then that'll put you in front of people who might not see you. And it gives you an opportunity for them to see you, for them to see your experience and your exposure, and for you to market to them for potential further business. So yes, it's okay to speak for free as long as you are speaking to the right audience. Speaking for free to the wrong audience is a waste of time. Speaking to an audience for money, that's the wrong target audience. In my mind, you losing the plot as a speaker. So knowing who you're targeting, knowing the level, a little bit about them, they spend their capital, the area of responsibility, knowing that they are the right people to make the decisions to hire you as a speaker or coach or consultant is key. Having that as a cheat sheet in your pocket when you're engaging everyday life and networking and looking for people on LinkedIn and at events is key. You've got to know that information so when that fish comes across your radar, you know exactly who to go after, but more importantly, who to let by for somebody else.